All this rain can be dangerous for driving. WVA's Leah Knight has some safety precautions we should all adhere to. It is dangerous out there. That's what Captain Terry Jacobs says about Tuscaloosa's flooded streets. When you have more than two or three inches of rain at one time, then you're going to have some areas that are very dangerous to cross or drive through. Jacob says the most common mistakes people make on rainy days come from being in a rush. Generally, being in a hurry, not realizing that it's, it's not the same as a sunny day drive, um, hitting your brakes when you begin to slide, you need to let off your brake when you begin to slide or hydroplane. You'll see the water on the road and you just need to slow down before you get there and ease through it. We spoke with the general manager here at Buffalo Fields and he says on days like today there's an even bigger demand for delivery and that he is doing everything possible to make sure his drivers are safe. Anytime there's inclement weather, we go over just the basics, you know, of driving skills, what to do, what not to do. We just kind of reiterate that to them just to be safe and to make sure they're making the right decisions when they're out there. Accidents often happen while driving through flooded streets, and Williams is not taking Tuscaloosa's weather conditions lightly. We take, we take this very seriously. We take the safety of all of our employees, whether they're out driving on the streets or whether they're actually in the restaurant. We take their safety and our safety, the safety of our customers, very seriously. Williams says if driving conditions ever worsen, the restaurant will stop taking delivery orders. Reporting in Tuscaloosa, Leah Knight, WBUA News. According to FEMA's website, it only takes two feet of water to sweep your car away. That includes SUVs.